We will only find out by time how durable this helmet is because there are actually a few things I want to point out about this helmet. But before I get into that, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you are having an amazing day. You guys already know how I am and how I like to waste nobody's time. If some of you guys are not aware, I actually reviewed this helmet over two years ago. When I first started mountain biking, I was not safe and I was going out there in the trails not using a helmet at all even though there were small trails, like literally just hiking trails, but still. And you guys know how I also like to be on a budget. So I purchased this $40 helmet off Amazon. One of the things that I do wanna point out is that when I purchased this helmet, I, I did a lot of research. I went to every website that was selling this helmet, looking at all the descriptions, and none of them said that this was adjustable. And I think they were right. This was not meant to be adjustable, but I kind of made it adjustable on accident. Let me explain. When I was doing that 30 day trail challenge, in one of the trails, I actually hit the top of the helmet and from the impact of that tree, boom, it broke that plastic that was surrounding this bolt right here. And it sort of made it adjustable on its own. Let me actually just explain. As you guys can see right here where this bolt is and this plastic clip, this will be like a U-shaped clip with an opening in the middle where the plastic actually clips on that bolt that you see right here. It wasn't like that. It, like, trust me guys, I was looking at every website and none of them mentioned that it was adjustable. Thank God I haven't been in a serious crash in the trails, but for the past two years, this helmet has held up pretty well. Apart from the scuff on the top and the loose visor, this helmet has been awesome. I just wanna say thank you guys so much for watching this video. And before I actually end the video, guys, I just wanna say that recently I've been putting out a lot of shorts but there's a reason why I've been putting a lot of shorts. Putting these shorts out daily is bringing in new growth for the channel. And those shorts, I do actually promote the long form videos I get them from. And ever since I've been uploading shorts, I've seen the biggest growth on my channel ever. And that is the reason why I've been putting out shorts daily because it's adding so much growth to the channel. Seeing new subscribers, talking to new subscribers, seeing them comment and just getting to know you guys even more. And with all that being said, I hope you guys understand that we have to set goals. Yes, we have to set goals because we are in this together. You guys supporting and watching this channel, it really means a lot to me. There's been times throughout the years where I have these gaps, gaps of not uploading anything at all so my mindset is to leave you guys with something daily to watch and i understand that some of you guys have already watched those clips but those clips reach a bigger audience and with all that being said i want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you made it all the way to the end and you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button right now and turn on the bell notification so you get notified every single time that i upload thanks for watching guys but for right now have a blessed day Thank <laughs> you.